So what is RAM and what does it do in your computer? Let's check it out. So this is a typical desktop motherboard. Obviously it would look somewhat different in a laptop. This right here is the RAM. So if we take the RAM out, we see that it's eight gigs of RAM, PC3, which stands for DDR3, at 12800. 12800 is the speed of the RAM. So there's basically three types of RAM that are in existence in today's modern world. There's DDR2, DDR3, and DDR4. So here is the current standard DDR4. The way I like to describe it is lanes of traffic. So you have DDR2, which was around from like 2005 to 2010. Then you have DDR3, which is around 2010 to 2015. And then you have DDR4, which is uh, 2015 to now. So DDR2 would be basically uh, just two lanes of traffic uh, going about 45 miles an hour. Then you would have DDR3, which is, you know, two lanes of traffic maybe going about uh, 60 miles an hour. Then you have DDR4, which is just like full on four lanes of traffic going about 75 miles an hour. So why this is important is the speed of the RAM matters. How fast it moves is going to really d dictate how fast you're surfing the web or running Microsoft Office or any of those things. So obviously DDR4 with more lanes of traffic and a higher speed is going to mean a faster computer. There are other elements like a solid state drive and things like that, but... So the more RAM you have, the better the overall performance of your computer. The RAM is actively storing information on a short-term basis. So think of it like a bookshelf. You've asked your computer to put a book on the bookshelf, but the bookshelf is crowded. So obviously the more room you have on your bookshelf, the more amount of RAM you have, the easier it is for your computer to access that in a fast and efficient manner. So how do you find out what kind of RAM your computer has? Go to crucial.com. There's a scanner there. Click scan my computer and then it will tell you what type of RAM that you have, the maximum capacity of your computer, and you can even order from the site. So in summary, adding RAM to your computer can significantly increase the overall efficiency and speed of your machine. I hope this helped a lot of folks, and please remember to like my page and subscribe. Thanks again. We'll see you next time.